Jolon True, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Jamie Plays with me, Jamie. Today we are playing again as the Romulan Star Empire in Star Trek New Horizons. Um, in the last episode, we've really kind of expanded our borders, and we're going to keep doing that and probably start yeah, coming into conflict with some of our neighbors. For example, we've already sabotaged things in the Benzarian Commonwealth, and I'm sure we will continue to do to do that. So those star bases are building stuff as they should be. The Bureau of Alien Affairs. They're pushing for friendly relations with alien species. Um you, yeah, oh yeah, you were in their territory. Let's survey that system. And then let's go up here. And try and stop them from expanding up that way if possible. Actually, you. Let's still survey that system. And then what we'll do is go this way for now. We will soon hit kind of a dead end ish area. So if the Andorians expand this way, it's okay because we'll have this. Um, and then we'll definitely expand. This way and this way and see who we can meet. So new research. Let's go for the deuterium collector, neutron enricher, import deuterium, and let's go for a Riemann crew. Production ship, you're there. Let's move you right here for now. And you're here waiting for this one to finish, yep, which is gonna take a while. Perfect. You here, you're building the two interceptors, and then we'll have two more interceptors, and it will be glorious. If we look at our ship designers, these are our interceptors. And this is the, the rear class, this is what we've had until just now. You can upgrade. Yeah, let's set you to upgrade as well. So those birds of prey will upgrade. After the interceptors are built, of course. Imperial construction project. So those two have now been built, that's perfect. So our naval capacity has increased. Interesting, we're meeting another menace. Actually, something else we should do in our edicts. Let's go for the research grant. That will increase our research speed by 5%. Let's also go uh, in the oversight committee. Let's disrupt relations between foreign powers, the Andorians, um, with the Benzarian Commonwealth. Yep, and let's go for... Um, go for low intensity negotiations still. Oh, Bolaris, okay, so you have with no business being over there. Let's move you up here. And actually, you can just come up here because there's no point in surveying system where the Bolian League already exists. Oh, and of course our science ship was forced to retreat. New research. Let's go for population management. Turns, yep, today. So let's have you Survey that one, and then that one, and then that one. And this construction ship, yeah, you're moving. Let's move you there. Oh, excellent. We were able to, um, yeah, again, relations between the two have fallen. So how are we doing fleet-wise? 
Andorians are superior. Benzarians are superior as well. Oh, and they're now rivals. That's perfect. So they won't. They won't. They don't like each other. You. We could. You're considered equivalent. I wonder if you will be considered equivalent after. Oh, well, the upgrades I don't think will be much use in terms of fleet power. But it would be nice to go after the Bolians quickly if possible. So new research. Let's go for the pro protein fabricator. You here, we can still build facilities. Let's go for the central computer core and the defense grid. Actually, definitely defense grid. Let's do that for both. And actually for this one as well. Good. Oh, and you can upgrade again. So how are we doing on our planets? You can upgrade. Let's do that. Negotiations for appointing a new praetor are underway. Nothing and nothing there. Hmm. Yep, I'm not going to take part in this. Cool. So we now have another, we've re-elected our current ruler. Oh, the Iota Menace, who we can research. So, you're down there, still can't do anything. You're up there and can't do anything. I'm actually wondering if it would be a good idea to have another giant ship. Excellent, we've met the Synthi Patriarchy. Oh, their lodge. Okay. And what are you? Germanic imperialists. Okay. New tradition. Let's complete the frontier tradition. And that gives us an ascension perk. And then here, let's go for the... Um, the interstellar dominion. That will help us to expand right now. New research, let's go for um, the shield hit points increase. Nope, oh, closed borders from the Zinti Patriarchy, understood. Why don't we do the trick again of buying alloys? Get rid of some of you and some of you. We are now making one latinum per month, so get rid of some latinum. Supplies, food, and then let's go for alloys, just like that. So, switch to the fleet manager and, yep, build the last ship. That's perfect. So, doing all the upgrades and then it will build that final interceptor. Great, so last set of upgrades, we're, o we're over a thousand military power, great. New res so research that um, anomaly. Ah, oh, I took that system. It looks like, hmm, is there anyone that we could, Green Republic who was our vassal is inferior. Everyone else though seems to be equivalent in their fleet power. Which is unfortunate, but hopefully not for very long. Let's have you upgrade again. Oh, there is intriguing, lost in space. You don't have time. For Let's go for intriguing and then you research projects and then survey the rest of the system or of those systems, I should say. Maybe we'll get a free ship. 
this science vessel. Yes, let's have you do these ones just in case we might actually be able to get them. Although I doubt it. And then we will focus on expanding kind of this way. Oh, this is worrying because we failed the project. New research. Let's go for automatic exploration. That will also be helpful. Critical failure. Oh, we lost a science ship. Oh, well, that's not good. Okay, science ship, rather than going that way, we definitely want to finish that. We then also want to go down this way, like that. And then round like that, and I definitely need new science ships. Let's build two of them if possible. Yes. And then move you to the very top, like so. And we will replace these science ships as quickly as possible. Um, let us sabotage an enemy starship. Let's go for the Bolian League and medium intensity negotiation. We now have so you, let's give you a scientist, you'll get the, I guess we'll just go for the youngest one, go down and go this way. Oh, wait, did I set this one to do it? Yes, I did. So you actually go this way, like that. And the other one, let's give you a scientist. Um, let's go here, and then let's go this way. Good. So hopefully we won't be too far behind in that case. And Polaris, yeah, you don't have... You don't have any allies don't have any allies at the moment. Oh, excellent. Um, served as a junior technician. Ah, okay, so the BLS Chud's crew, so the Chud has been lost. Looking here, oh, sorry, Bolax. They're still equivalent, but I guess that's one less ship to worry about. New research, let's go for the Plasma Torpedo, and I'll stay here because we're almost finished with this research as well. So new research, let's go for um, Telepathic Control. Imperial fleet upgraded. So it looks like we have enough naval capacity to start a new fleet. So let's do that. Create new fleet. Oh wait, why are you only at five? It says I can't build anymore. Six, seven. Why can't I reinforce? Hmm. Not sure. You are equivalent. I think everyone is basically equivalent at the moment. You're doing your stuff, you're doing your stuff, and you're going this way. Yep, perfect. And especially, I want to ruin relations with the Bolian League and the Benzarian Commonwealth whenever possible. I think that's what I'll do next, the next time that, that the Intelligence Committee pops up. That's what we shall focus on. Here on Remus, let's upgrade you. That will give us an extra job. These ones can upgrade as well. Eric, Romy, okay. New research. 
let's go for the matter fabricator and alloy production increase. We need 2,000. That's how we will get rid of the legacy of Koril. Oh, you can upgrade again. Uh, new research. Oh, sorry. New anomaly, I should say. You still have a little bit of a ways to go. So let's have you move down here, the Belloc system. 5, 13. Actually, you probably can just move there completely. Third fleet has been upgraded. Good. Oh, let's prepare the grappler. Awaken the uh, capsule's occupants. And this is unfortunate because uh, they, are, they have strange behavior and they murdered one of my crewmen. But nothing we can do about that now. So they are still expanding. Maybe we don't really need the influence increase at the moment, but we could, yeah, declare rivalries against some of these places. Also, we do have an envoy that we're not using. Oh yeah, disrupt relations between major powers. Let's go for the Bolian League and target the Benzorian Commonwealth. Go for high intensity negotiations. I mean, we have the influence for it. Oh, and you here. Let's build that outpost. You, why can't... It's already at full strength, but you're not at full strength because you're missing two interceptors. Okay, Romulus, you can build another building. Let's see kind of what's down here, what's left. Trade center. We don't have enough latinum at the moment. Um... Let's go for the admin center. No, not right now. Let's first go for the heroic landmark, I think. Oh, excellent. They have damaged relations. Nope. And you, okay, rather than going that way, Let's go to that one and build the outpost first. You've claimed that system, so let's build all the mining stations possible, and then have you move there. Interesting, there's the Lambda Menace and the Delta, uh, sorry, the Kappa Menace. So Romy here, let's give you, let's go for the Frontier Hospital. The Vulcan High Command. You're no match for us, Vulcans. Rivaled by Benzarians, let us try to form their relations with the Vulcans as well. So new research, let's go for... Sonic Disruptor Field and the Secondary Plasmadyne Relay. The Vulcans have closed their borders, not unexpected. Oh, we've met United Earth, so now it might be a good idea to harm relations with the United Earth, or between United Earth and the Vulcans.
But they are pathetic. That's good. How are the Vulcans? Superior. Andorians are equivalent. Hmm. So, Terex, you can build something. Let's go for the Frontier Hospital. New research. Let's go for the Super Collider, Bio Lab, Material Prototype Lab. Um, you here, let's build these stations and then go for a research outpost down there. Oh, sorry, not a research outpost, I mean a um, an outpost down there. You upgrade, and I think I'm going to have to build those last two interceptors manually. Well, anyway, let's zoom back out, because I definitely don't have enough alloys at the moment to do that. I'm definitely going to be expanding mostly at the moment. Oh, new anomaly. Moving. Can we yep, we can build a star base. New research, let's go for the Elf Thruster, and you upgrade. Um, here, let's go for, um, I guess, let's say full reverse. Oh, and we were able to elude them. Great, so that person gains 50 experience. Yeah, because as the, the Romulans, we wouldn't have submitted to somebody else. We would have preferred that our ship was destroyed. But we'll soon have that system. Soon have this Ata system. You will pay the price for opposing. Ooh, declare rivalry from the Bolian League. Yep, I'll declare rivalry back. I cannot. Yeah. Greater than pathetic, but less than overwhelming can be declared as rivals. Well, they definitely, as equivalent, they definitely fit that. Their war. Can't do any of that. Anyway, let us disrupt relations and let's go with the Vulcan High Command and United Earth relations and high intensity. Great. For research, let's go for the Artificial Singularity Core 3. You are building a star base. You are also going to build a star base. Imperial construction project complete. Good. Oh, so it looks like we won't get the Desca system. Unfortunately. Oh, maybe we will. We can try. Excellent. They've condemned the Vulcan High Command individuals involved in the communication. Excellent. So, build those and then move there. Oh, maybe we will have a construction issue. Oh, the Vulcan High Command is going for Desica. Interesting. Yep, it's going for Desica. Okay, well, in that case, you do the research station here, and then move, well, stay there for right now.
Good, good. Good value of two. Dilithium. Ooh, new tradition. Now, should we go for cunning? Allows us to subjugate and vassalize other empires. Supremacy increases Starbaker's capacity. Hmm. Or purity increases planetary build speed. Innovation as pop upkeep. Discovery is anomaly research. Prosperity building upkeep. Ship build cost minus ten percent. Let's go for cunning first. I know one of our factions really wants us to have cunning. Yeah, another one wants supremacy. Uh, research. Yeah, see, now the Vulcans are right there. You're now equivalent, okay. So you. Okay, well, let's start with you. Mining stations and the research station. And then go build a star base. You are going to have to move down here. Scientific move there. Imperial fleet upgraded. Ender. Yeah, there are only five. No, wait, seven. I think seven things there. Two, three, four, five, seven. Yep. Oh, new research. Let's go for the habitability and ecological campaign. Third fleet, you can upgrade again, so let's do so. I wish it was possible to see exactly how, like, the relations between other empires. I mean, it's obviously calculated, it's just not... Oh, incoming intelligence. They've discovered something alarming. A group of humans have declared a state for themselves in a star system they named the Novan Centara, claiming to be inheritors of the great Khanate under Khan Nunian Singh. Whoever that may be, their population is comprised of genetically engineered supermen and women gestated from caches of embryos left over from an ancient earth war. This is worrying, this is none of our concern. This is worrying. But where is that system? I guess we can't see, okay. Remarkable vessel. You, rather than going that way, you're going to explore there. Let's survey this system and then go this way. Oh, and we need to do all of our things again. Go for the farmer festival, the farming subsidy, production targets, and capacity overload. Just unfortunately, we can't do the health reforms yet. You, because you can't explore up there anyway, go uh, this way, like that. You, what's that? I guess let's go that way, like that. The Vulcans are really kind of being a bit snaky in there, yeah, and how they're expanding. Um. I'll wait for that to finish surveying, and then I will go for that anomaly. Oh, inner light. Let's go um, fire disruptors. Full power to weapons. And, oh, unfortunately the scientist dies. But, it's okay. Now, research that anomaly, and you get a new scientist. That one. And 
Where are you? Oh, you were here. Let's continue this as we were going to. And there, there, and there. And play a rivalry from the Vulcan High Command. Can we do it back? Make claims, declare rivalry. Confirm, let us disrupt um, with the uh, disrupt relations, Vulcan High Command. And let's go for the Earth. Turn it to Earth again, because they're in a coalition and I would like to break that if possible. Interesting, more menaces. So, you research. Oh, we've met the Nausicans. They're no match for us. Oh! And rather than just being a single system, they are kind of snaky as well. New research. Let's go for the primitive synthetic dilithium manufacturing, and we can finally explore, exploit the dilithium resource. Close borders from the Nausicans, not surprising. Upgrade our fleet. League of Planets. Oh, okay. Oh, so the Tellarites and the Andorians are in a separate... So the League of Planets is one coalition, and the Coalition of Planets is another coalition. Great, that means the Federation won't form, because you need three of them to, f to form. Oh, that's perfect. So... No match for us, Tellarite. Interesting. Return to primary operations. So it looks like the Federation won't be forming in this game unless something changes you drastically. Yes. Which will be great. Oh, an excellent. Earth has condemned the Vulcans. Actually, it would be good if we could break up the Tellarites and the Andorians as well. Maybe we should definitely, well not maybe, we should definitely try that at some point. Tellarites close their border, that's not surprising. Oh, we've met the Klingons. You'll find you're no match for us Klingons. This is going to be a bit difficult. Oh, yep, you here. Build that outpost. So, we definitely need to make sure that our our fleets are fully powered and that we have we can really build lots of fleets. But we have no time for this. We wouldn't help anyone anyway. Who do you think we are? We are the Romulan Star Empire. Let us sell the minerals, and let's sell some food, and some latinum, and topoline, and tolunian crystals, and some dilithium. Let's buy tons of alloys, and then here at Romulus let's go for two interceptors, and those will be our final additions to third fleet, and then that will be fully operational. What we could also do is ex make is actually colonize something. Let's go for Norcan 2. Actually, let's go for Belak 4. No, this one because it's a tw size 24. And let's go for Romulan. And then, oh, almost can build those mining stations. You, oh, you're already building the star base. So you can now build the mining stations. New research. Let's go for the naval supply depot. That will be really helpful. Or there. Oh, okay. So you. Build the mining stations, and then move. Then move there.
And actually, then you are going to move there. Yep, new research. Let's go for the uh, Magnus or Alloy Mega Forges Distillery 2. Let's go for that. Oh, and fascinating. Short, uh, short range transmitter has been located on the surface of Alderon 4. Sounds good. Oh, somehow I skipped that system. How did I skip that system? You. Yeah, we'll finish that survey. Survey that system, then go there, and then come back to these ones. Don't know what, how that one got skipped, or why it was, well, probably it was skipped, not on purpose of course, but uh, on accident because of its proximity to the other ones and being covered by the name, and I just never realised. You... So, great. Um, can we then... Yep, build the outpost already. You, let's build that post already. And you still have 14, so that's that will be fine. Yep, so this should be good. You do those ones, and then we can automatically explore. I think name that one, and then that one, and then come over this way. Let's again send a military vessel, and you. Let's yeah, research projects over there. New research. Let's go for the shield component. And then you will come back for upgrades like that. Ooh. Now there's the Kai aliens, or the Kai menace. Ooh, Benzarians and the Zinti patriarchy. Great. You are still a part of that coalition. Oh, and this is excellent, the Sonar Command. Actually, it probably would be a good idea to get the Vulcans and the Endorians hating each other. They don't already. Oh, the Orion Trade Union joined the Coalition of Planets. That's not good. Our presence would indicate that it. Hmm. That's definitely not good. But if, definitely if we can get those two hating each other, the Andorians and the Vulcans, that would be good. <laughs> He's suffering from paranoia. So let's go for the Vulcan High Command, and let's go with the... Nope. Get a new dossier. Yep, the Andorian Empire. High Intensity Negotiations. Great. And the Orions have closed their border to us. Not surprising. Good, so I'm going to put a cut in here. I hope you have enjoyed this episode so far. If you have, please remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time for another episode. See you then. Bye.